what you're seeing on screen right now are ads created entirely using AI, but not for small creators, but for some of the biggest brands in the world. Instead of hiring video editors, these companies directly went to AI specialists or prompt engineers. And this is not a future prediction. This is happening right now. AI has basically become the new cameraman, the new editor and the new cinematographer. And honestly, the results are shocking. Some of these clips look better than real production. Did you see the jump from Nano Banana to Nano Banana Pro? The improvement is insane. We have reached a point where you genuinely cannot tell what is real and what is AI generated. Also, we'll talk about the best video editing model that we have ever seen. This is world's first unified multi-video model that does everything in one place. Think of it like Nano Banana but for videos, where you can add, remove or modify anything you want. You can change the background or environment, add, swap or remove objects. So in this video, I'll tell you the best techniques that you can start using in your own workflow because like it or not, the industry has already changed and the time to ignore AI has long gone. I'll be using Hicks field to test out the latest techniques, capabilities and models. What has changed? Think about this for a second. ChatGPT came out only three years ago and today almost everyone uses it. At first, people were skeptical, unsure and hesitant. And then suddenly it became the default tool. Right now, I don't know anyone who doesn't use ChatGPT. The same shift is happening with AI video. For the past years, thousands of new tools launched, but most were not good enough for real creative work. They were fun to experiment with, but not something you would use in a real client project. Until now, Nano Banana 2 just released. For the first time, this feels genuinely production ready, something you can confidently use in real edits, ads and client projects. This is what makes this upgrade a massive jump. First, physics-based simulations. You get real-world weight, gravity, reflections, materials and motion. Which means editors can now generate realistic product spins, floating shots without 3D or VFX. Which means you can also create natural slow motion movement without simulations. Second, Google level world knowledge. The new models understand maps, architecture, lighting and real environments. Which means as an editor, you can build a studio room, cafe or subway scene that looks exactly like the real location. You can also instantly recreate YouTube style background or trending creator setups. Third, geolocation rendering, which means you just enter coordinates and time and it will give you accurate sunlight, shadows and atmosphere. Which means as an editor, you can match outdoor lighting in multiple shots using AI. Fourth and the most important one, which is character consistency. Faces, geometry and scenes stay consistent across generations, which means you can create 10 to 20 shots of the same actor for an ad or story without face glitches. And you can also build a complete sequence with wide, medium and close-up shots with matching appearances. And fifth, knowledge-based visuals. The models know how objects move and interact naturally. Which means hair, clothing and props move realistically without manual animation. With these upgrades, you can start creating visuals which you can use in actual client projects. The first part that I wanted to try was visual effects inside Hicks field. Usually when we are working on client projects and we need a wow factor in the video, we rely on VFX. But VFX takes hours and hours of work. From tracking, compositing, masking, tree framing, the whole thing can take you few days. But inside Hicks fail, I found hundreds of plug and play VFX templates where you don't have to build anything manually. You literally just replace the placeholder image with your own videos and the effect is done. Here are the favorite effects that I tried. First, Earth zoom in and out. This one is perfect for viral Instagram reels, real estate videos, any cinematic location reveal transition. You might have seen this one on Instagram already. It looks like a complex 3D zoom out that naturally takes multiple layers and keyframes, but here you can generate it in one click. Second one that I really like this wireframe effect. It turns a subject or background into a digital wireframe model, super futuristic, clean and technical. It's perfect for montage transitions or textile videos. You can also use it in sci-fi edits. And the third one is building explosion. This one is so fun, a full building explosion you can drop into a montage or action style edit. Something that would normally require 3D assets or stock VFX. Done in just few minutes. And honestly, these are just a few. There are hundreds more inside the library. You can mix, remix and stack them to create insane transitions that would usually take hours to pull off. Just pick the movement, upload your frame and your shot instantly feels like a real production. Second feature that I really like is camera movement in Hicks field. One of the biggest problems in client projects is when they give you static shots with zero movement. Normally we would add keyframes and a fake zoom in but they don't look truly cinematic. But inside Hicks field, you can get simple camera movements like dolly in, dolly out, handle drift or subtle parallax motion. You can also go for epic camera moves like 
bullet time, FPV drone, Dutch angle, through object shots. These really feel like they were shot using real rigs, not edited in post. Even the most boring still shots become cinematic and dynamic. Next feature that I really liked is making your own character in Higgs field. One of the coolest feature right now is creating your own AI character or avatar. Basically a digital version of yourself or your client that you can use for endless content. You just upload 20-30 photos of yourself and the system learns your unique look and few minutes. After that you can generate infinite selfies, portraits and stylized shots without ever taking a real photo. This is going viral right now. People are creating AI influencers who post every day without a single photo shoot. And for editors and brands this is extremely useful. Now if a client wants to promote images and videos of themselves, you can create the character using 20 to 30 images. Add their product by placing the character plus product in Nano Banana. Then use any video model to animate the shot and then add camera movements for a realistic and cinematic feel. So in short, you can do a complete photo shoot or video shoot without camera sets or retakes. Next I want to talk about Soul in Paint inside Higgs Field, which is basically AI based retouching for video. If you want to change something in a shot, you just highlight the part and type a prompt. Clothes, hair, objects, background, anything. And the best part, it keeps the same face identity so the character never breaks. This is insanely useful for video editors because you can fix outfits or change styles instantly, remove distractions in the background, add accessories, props or redesign parts of the scene and create multiple ad variations without reshoot. No masking, no rotoscoping and no frame by frame work. Just select, describe and done. Now we come to the craziest part. This is the most insane AI video editing model that we have ever seen. Kling O1. In simple words, it's nano banana but for videos. You can literally edit a video like it's Photoshop file, change the background or environment, add, swap or remove objects, replace people or restyle them, ask for completely new angles, modify the whole scene just by typing what you want. It gets even crazier when you start adding elements. You can upload reference images of your character from multiple angles, upload logos, products, props or style references and tell it how to integrate them in a shot. The model understands the visual context on its own. You can even have multiple characters in the same scene and it will track each one separately with pixel perfect consistency. This is how it works. Go to Higgs field and under video go to Klingo 1 advanced video editing. Here upload a reference video, upload images or elements and in the prompt box just describe in plain English what you want. Then hit generate. For editors this means that they have a VFX compositing and cleanup team inside a single model. And honestly everything that I've showed you in this video is just the beginning. Hicksfield has so many tools and models that have barely scratched the surface. There are features like click to add, draw to video, sketch to video, UGC factory, video upscale, banana placement and product placement and even multi-reference editing. The deeper you go, the more insane possibilities get. The platform is moving so fast that the best way to learn is by trial and error. Test the models, break things, tweak prompts, that's how you figure out what works for your style. This is the future of editing and we are just getting started. Don't forget to subscribe.